Zimbabwe's decade-long economic problems have predictably impacted the country's service delivery. Poor waste and sewage management has seen underground water getting contaminated, denying Harare residents clean and safe water for daily consumption. We urge you to test your borehole water. Can I win a borehole? Please test your borehole water. No matter who you are, don't assume that your borehole is good. No, not anymore. Some households have gone over a decade without water from the taps. Their hope has been the current rains that have filled up most water bodies. The Harare City Council supplies a paltry 55% of the water required, leaving many residents to find alternative ways of accessing water. Many residents have resorted to drilling boreholes, but sadly, this have been contaminated by overflowing sewage that is spread around by flood waters. After testing most of the bowls in Narare for the quality of water, we have seen that uh, more than 90% of those bowls are contaminated with fecal or uh, with uh, coliforms, which is a proxy for fecal matter, which means that uh, sewage and uh, and drinking water is somehow mixed. So we are not saying people should not drink because there is no water coming from the tents most of the time. Zimbabwe is currently battling a typhoid outbreak which has mainly been blamed on poor waste and water management. The outbreak has claimed two lives and led to the hospitalization of over 200 people since December last year. Residents are now advised to boil all water or use water treatment chemicals before consuming any water from any source. Now, access to water is a right in the Zimbabwean constitution, which stipulates that every person has the right to safe, clean and portable water.